goes. Hello, and welcome to Invisible Gamer Plays. I'm Tristan. And I'm Dan. We're playing Hotline Miami 2 Wrong Number. Um, and we're killing a guy. Yep. Okay, that is very violent. <laughs> we're um, I, in the set of a movie right now. There's a lot going on right off the bat. We're in, you know, so you never played the first Hotline Miami, correct? No, I haven't. Me neither. Um, I know of it, though, a lot more than you do. <laughs> Because you never this even. This is the second one. Yes, this is Hotline Miami Two. I don't remember. Um, yeah, I've heard of it, but I haven't actually like. I don't know why I can't. Anything with this. You moving the right way? Yeah, I don't know why I can't. Um, you got a hammer in your hand. Shoot, L one is to throw it. I don't know why all of a sudden I can't. Did you throw your hammer? Yeah. Do you still have it with you? No, I threw it. I don't know why I can't. Can move you get around. it back? Okay. <gasps> yes, I can. I just don't know why I will can't you, aim. Can you get it back? Oh, because I'm locked on to these guys. Will That's you kill fun. the people? Yeah. Will you beat them up? Senseless? Will yeah, you? here's the thing with this game, Dan. Is that. Oh, gosh. Oh, my God. It's, it's really <laughs> intense. Like, you can die really <laughs> easily. Um, what? What are we? Looks like we're a fat dude. Yeah, well, I think we're wearing up. a pig mask. Oh, it's like the GTA and the pig mask. Kind of. Why does he look fat to me, though? Because I think it is a fat dude. Um, oh, fat bastard. <coughs> fat bastard. Yeah, she's upstairs. Go get her. So we're on the set of a movie right now. So we're getting we're, a girl? Yeah. Um, who is she? I don't know. It's a movie. The, the Queen of England? I never played the first time anyway is what I was getting at, but... Um, oh, my gosh. Oh, is that thunder? Oh, I thought that was like the power up, like no. sound, like you got a shotgun. Thunder. I don't know. No, I don't think so. <laughs> um, I never played the first Hotline Miami, and I guess there's like lots of plot going on in this one. I'm not quite sure what happened there. I'll follow the script. Okay, um, wow. I have no idea what's happening. <coughs> I have oh. no idea what's happening. I forgot. How do you? So he's uh, killing some people. Oh, he just killed a naked dude. Where'd my shotgun? Why you know? did you? Why does he like stomp on their heads? <laughs> That's how you kill people. Well, why? Why is he gonna kill him? Like he's dog about. Oh shit. Oh. Uh. Oh, uh, that was the, okay. So I know when this game, before this game came out, there was some controversy about rape and shit. Did he just rape her? Yeah. Holy crap. I know there's some con. That's why it's, I, no, you didn't see this, but before it said, do you want to keep in the scenes of graphic violence? And I said, yes. Or I said, Gosh. or I said, I don't want to leave. <laughs> but it's within the context of a movie, I guess, but still. Does it like... Pigman, well done, but don't be afraid to be rougher. You're supposed to be killing people, make it look like you really hit them. You need their blood, you need to work on your femininity. Wow, that's pretty fucked up. Yeah, so oh I... Oh my gosh. Okay, cool. That was, That uh, was the intro. I guess we'll continue. That is, what? <laughs> I, like I said, I've never played the first one. Uh, that was Midnight Animal. That's what we just did. Let's go to Exposition, Act 1. Oh, I don't know what's happening. Jasper burned Voyagers at the music down under first scene. It's cool because it's like the VHS. Yeah. Skip intro? No, let's see what's going on. Maybe this will give us some... It's exposition, so maybe it'll tell us what happened in the first game. <laughs> yeah. Because I have no idea. All I know, I maybe, I know you were like, you got calls to go kill people and you put on masks and masks did different things. Oh, it's 1991 by now. The first game was definitely 80s, but now it's 91. Man, this party stinks. I fucking hate these people. Yeah, see, like, they're wearing masks. I, I, I don't know. People really like these games, though. Like, they very, they really do evoke... Yeah. Their time period, you know what I mean? I guess this is not 80s by now, but this is, um, what? 91. Oh, really? Yeah, that's what I just said. Crap. Um, was I supposed to do that? Oh, I c probably could have explored a little bit more. Down there. under. A land down under. Oh, yeah, see? We can pick, but I only have Zebra? one. Cory, roll dodge. Ah, oh, shit. They're sick of this shit, so I gotta go... Okay, I... Let me check the controls. <laughs> Lock, R1 is attack, I want is... The, I'm kind of confused. Finish roll is X, look is L2, lock on is R2. Yeah, uh... That's how you roll, okay. 
Do we have a gun? See? Did see they, how hard it just, is? They just killed us. Yeah. Okay, let me see if there's a way around. If I can get in somewhere else. We're around the house? Is this a house? It's a building of some kind. Nope, I just gotta fucking get in there. What the fuck? <laughs> okay! <laughs> There's no way around it. You can die. Okay, I can look. I forget that L2 is how you like look forward. Oh, so you gotta use stealth. Yeah, I know this game is really intense. So let's see. All right, just break in there. That guy's patrolling around. Okay, the guy with the shotgun. How about that? Yeah. Oh fuck. Yeah. Shit. If you open the fuck. Fuck. Why do you have to stomp their heads in crap? <laughs> you don't have to. <laughs> Fuck. I don't. I think I fucked up. There's probably something I could get. It's <laughs> like holy crap. It's just so brutal. Shit. Oh my gosh. Go pick it up. Get over here, bitch ass. Okay. Get him. Get. Oh, you got a baseball bat. Now. Yeah, you can use the doors to like knock them down. Um, but I don't want the baseball bat, I want the shotgun now. Yeah, it's a lot better choice. Alright, open the door. Yes, okay. Headshot. I can see why people like this game. <laughs> why, because the, the gun? Just like it's stuff? very, uh, um, to use a marketing buzzword, visceral. What's that mean? It's just very, you feel it. When you bust in and shoot them, you're like, yeah, fuck yeah, you know? You're like, I'm really feeling it. Shit. Wait. What? Did you get your shotgun back? Shit, I did get it back and then I lost it again. What? <laughs> Damn. What? What'd you do? Well, I thought I could pick up the other one or something and get ammo or... Shit. I know you have a sword. Is that a sword? It's like a knife. So you can, like, uh... Does he have a okay, gun? Okay, he has a shotgun. Alright. Is that... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, do I see his intestines? Very possibly. Okay. What is that floating thing? It looks like an intestine. Like right there. Oh no, that's like the. Oh, I guess that's what we were using. It's like a whip. <laughs> Looked. No, you took his. Uh, his oh shit. You took part of his stomach out and you like whip people with it. Oh my it. god, fuck. Okay. <laughs> Think of how brutal that would be. Like you whip people with his stomach. Gosh. I'm sorry, I'm concentrating. It's hard to g have lively conversation. You know, and why wouldn't they all just, like, hear the gunshot and then, like, run towards there? Fuck, I keep moving. You know, you think they would all just hear the gunshot and just yeah, you'd try to kill you. think. But, you know, that logic. Fuck! This game's pretty hard, Dan. Is it? Well, certainly not soft. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Okay, I don't know how to... What the best strategy is here. Shoot the guy. And shoot the guy. <laughs> okay. I was really close to now that I am. Okay, good, get another gun. The more guys with guns. Oh, fuck. How are you open the door halfway? Just, oh, there's a guy right there. Wasn't there another guy? There's a guy in there. Oh, okay. Watch him kill you. Not! <laughs> Fuck yeah! Level clear? Yep. Go to the car. Oh gosh. So, wait, why do we do this? We just came in here to murder everybody? Yeah, that's what I mean. I think the plot is that you're like a hitman guy kind of dude. <laughs> so, we're a mercenary? I don't know. I, I, we're I don't in Miami, know. so we're probably on cocaine. I'm so confused about this game because, like. We never played just, the first one. Well, it started up this one guy. Freaking raping lady. Yeah, that was pretty fucked up. Like, I, like I said, I remember that being a big controversy. And 
I don't know. It was, I don't know. Let's see. Oh, this is. I remember this part from the first game. Who the heck is that guy? I mean, I didn't play it, but I've seen parts of it. I think I actually played the very beginning of Hotline Miami 1, because I got it for free on PlayStation Plus. 1450s here. Pizza's on the counter to your left. Enjoy your meal and watch out for Ghost Snow. Okay, bye. Now, this is like a perfect example of games being made by people that are like totally influenced by their childhoods. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like the people that grew up in the 80s and early 90s are now old enough to be making games and they're making yeah. fucking Hotline Miami 2. Exactly. Which is so retro and neon and shit. It's 91 now, but the first one took place in the 80s, I believe, late 80s or whatever, and it looks... I mean, it's we're very in that world. Yeah. All right, Dan, next time on Visible Gamer Plays, we're going to maybe figure out more. We're uh, going to try to not die. We're ignorant, so excuse us. Yeah.